finished recording, you may hang up or press pound for more options. Hey man, it's um, it's, it's me, Kevin. How uh, you been? Uh, sorry, I'm just out of it. So I hear that um, you didn't go to see uh, Caroline, which amazes me because I thought of all people you'd be the one to go see her right away then again I guess not where are you David David needs you man He's gone hysterical. And Carol, she's losing her mind. But... Who can blame them? You know who else isn't to blame? You. You're not to blame, Jared. You're not. Okay? Nobody blames you. Not David, and not Carol. And if, God damn it, if Caroline was still alive, she wouldn't blame you. It's not your fault. You didn't see that car coming. not your fault, okay? Nobody blames you. Only you. You need to stop that. That's too much. That's too much on yourself. I, I tried to make it to her funeral. But I couldn't get out of work. I'm already screwed over with the bills. There's no way I could miss work. But you could have been there. Why weren't you there, Jared? Why weren't you there? To console David and Carol. They need you. They need somebody who spent the last few seconds with their only daughter. At least give them that. I, just go see David. David needs you. Do it for Caroline. You were the closest person to Caroline. Everybody saw that. You were closer to her even more than David. Her own father. Now what does that say? Go see her. You need it. You need closure. If you don't go see her, it's going to haunt you. More than it already does. I can see why you're, you're hiding now. I can see why you've disappeared. But it's not fair. It... Then again... Who said life was fair? Well, I gotta go. But remember, Jared. Remember what mom used to tell us. Family is the backbone 
to any true happiness. Remember that. Well, I'll try, um, I'll try really hard to come see you guys. Please just go see David. He needs you. Bye.